The unloader valve routes the water in your pressure washer's pump to either the outlet hose or to recirculate within the pump when water is not being sprayed. Over time, the unloader valve can be locked in place by corrosion within the pump. When this occurs, pressurized water won't spray when the trigger valve is pressed. Replacing the unloader valve is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. Hi, I'm Mark Socha. Do-it-yourself repairs like these are easier than you might think. From lawn machines to cordless grills, kitchen mixers, outdoor grills, our how-to videos walk you through each repair from start to finish. So doing it yourself means never having to do it alone. Let's get started. I'll begin by separating the pump from the engine. With the screws removed, now I can remove the pump. Now I'll remove the button cap that secures the water deflector. With the deflector removed, I have access to the screws. I'll remove those next. Now I can remove the valve body and the spring. With the thermal relief valve out of the way, now I can remove the unloader valve. Now I can install the new unloader valve. It's recommended that you lubricate the lower o-ring with silicone grease and the upper o-ring with Teflon grease. And now I'll insert the unloader valve back into the pump body. And I'll finish up by reinstalling the pump. I'll place the key in the motor keyway and then align the pump's keyway with the one on the motor shaft. I'll slide the pump onto the shaft and secure it with the screws. And that's how easy it is to replace the unloader valve in your pressure washer. Be sure to check back often for new videos and expert advice. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment.